I don't sweat much for a fat bloke. That's, that's your opener. Well done. Thank you. I think seeing as you won the Genius Award, perhaps you knew something. I don't need, need to be slim and handsome when you're a genius. Yeah, so read it in the week, Stephen Hawking. What was it like to be presented by Patrick? Oh, it was great. I mean, look, it's like Crossroads. <laughs> Cracking reference from anyone under 38. Um, uh, it was great. No, he's, he's lovely. He's lovely. And he's, he's, he's such a weighty... I thought it was funny that he's such a weighty actor. And I'm an idiot. Um, and uh, I'm glad he said yes. Yeah. Why do you think you've won the genius sword? I, I, I can only think they went down a list of Nobel Prize winners. <laughs> and they weren't available. They went, right, OK. We... We couldn't get the bloke who isolated the genome. We couldn't, we couldn't do the guy who <laughs> cured cancer. We couldn't get the, as a guy. What about Ricky lives locally? <laughs> I don't know, it's, it's nice. It's, it's not to be taken seriously, but that doesn't make it any less flattering and an honor to, to be asked. And it, it, it's, I don't get out much. As, honestly, it doesn't get better than this. It was a wonderful event, but it's got to compete with a couch in my pyjamas, drinking wine with a cat on my lap, watching Narcos on Netflix. I mean, GQ Awards, brilliant. Best in the world. But a couch in my pants. Drunk. I already taken my pyjamas off. I'm already in my pants. That was about 30 seconds. It started off being pyjamas with a cat. Now I'm in my pants getting drunk. Okay? <laughs> Thank you. Zane's got a, a, a great voice. Uh, I'll just leave it at that. I haven't wanted to meet you. Uh, I, I, we haven't met each other yet. Got some lipstick on your teeth.